All right, guys, welcome to another special edition of Max Stories. And you know how we do our Max Stories. We bring you exceptional stories from exceptional Nigerians. And trust me, we always don't disappoint. On today's edition, we have another exceptional brother. Eh? The reason why I'm doing this, eh, you'll find out in the course of the show. My name, na Spotlight, and I'll be the last of my kind. <laughs> I got my man Spotlight here today. How you doing, bro? I'm good, bro. Welcome to the show. Thank you very much. Welcome to our corner. Thank you. That's Thank how you. we roll. <laughs> Why were you doing your hand like this? Yeah, they, they, they will find out. Oh, okay. They will find out. You okay. know, it's okay. like, it's a move. It's okay. It's a move. It's a, I'll learn some more. You'll learn. Yeah. Ah, I mean, now you go teach me. Yes, <laughs> okay, so Spotlight, how are you doing, though? I'm, I'm good. I'm You're good. welcome on the show. Well, let's start by, let's know your real name. Okay. Yes, what's your real name? My real name is Suleiman Omotola Ogegbo. Okay. Yes. The Ogebo is actually a short uh, form of a very long one. Ah. So I want to teach you right now. Okay, teach me. Oge Ego Igi Shogun. Oge Ego Igi Shogun. Yes. Hmm. <laughs> Name of the elders. <laughs> what does it mean? Do you, what, what does it mean? It's... My great grandfather, actually, he, uh, he was uh, uh, like, like this local. Uh, Harvest. He makes okay. yes. He makes okay. medicine. Out okay. of so what they do basically is they they peel the back of a tree. Yeah. Okay. So now let us go straight into the gist because yeah. uh, you are a stunt coordinator and an OAP. Yes, amazing. yes. Amazing. Yes. Amazing. And the journey has been good, right? Yes, yeah, really good. It's fun. I mean, I don't have to work nine to five. Yeah. I, I love having a conversation, talking about what's trending, you mm -hmm. know, just mm -hmm. basically informing and ent entertaining people. So, hmm. yeah, it's been now, fun now, all the way. Now, speaking about the entertainment part, was it uh, the entertainment love that prompted you into uh, movies? Okay. Um, first of all, I'm a very big love of action movies okay I love action movies and I, I mean I go to the cinemas almost every time and I tell myself that I can't go to the cinema to go and watch say like a love a love story, story. No, I, I can just yeah. download and watch or I, someone I collect from a friend yeah and I see how people wait two years one year uh -huh. three years uh -huh. for the sequel of a movie mm -hmm. to come out and i'm like and when it comes out people go out i remember when avengers came out i paid <sighs> five thousand naira <sighs> for popcorn and tickets yeah and that was a lot of people came out to watch it yeah. so i'm like why can't we make action movies in nigeria mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. so i just I, and i also wanted to stand out okay yeah i also wanted to stand out so i yeah, so I just decided, you know, why don't I just try it? Yeah. And when I tried it, it started working for me. People, st I started getting that attention on mm -hmm. social media. Mm -hmm. um, you know, people started gravitating towards me like, oh, this is new. So okay. now this is what I do. I can direct. Okay. I edit all my videos. Okay. I co coordinate and I choreograph all the stunts. We, I have a team mm -hmm. and we all work together. That's what we do. So I, I have a knowledge of everything, basically. Mm. So you're like a total package. They hire well, you now. They hire you some become. people wouldn't say I'm a total package because yeah. I've had a conversation with a couple of people and people will say there's, there, there are things that people are looking for in the industry. There's a look. Okay. They'll tell you, you have to be built some type of way. Yeah. You have to have a certain, you have to have, there's a features basically that yeah. Yeah. some of these uh, big time movie makers are looking for. Mm. I wouldn't say I perfect, I, I fit into that picture, but you know, well, maybe my skill mm -hmm. is making, you know, the right people gravitate towards me. So mm -hmm. I feel like I'm in the right direction. Now, let's, let's talk about the stunt market in Nigeria because uh, we are used to romantic movies. Uh, we try to stay away from action films because we don't know how to do it right. And you decided to get into this part of uh, film. Wasn't it, were you not scared knowing that Nigerians still don't, we've still not accepted it as our own yet? I think the reason why you said we've not accepted it yet is mm. because we're not doing it right. You also said We're that. not doing it right yet. So if we do it right, I feel like people would patronize. They will, they will basically, they will watch it. Mm. They will go out to see it. Trust me. Mm. The thing is, my secret, what I did, 
no one taught me like i said it, or they only taught me the basics when yes. it comes to editing yeah. i had to go on youtube i had to start buying tutorials online yeah. that was yeah. what i did okay and i'll sit down for hours and i watch then another thing that i did and i feel like if you are an upcoming director like me mm -hmm. and you want to do something very different you could just sit down take your time watch an american movie an action scene take your time and watch it frame by frame frame mm. by frame that way you can know where the camera angle is you can know where the punch is you can know where this and that you can mm. know when they, they do a little bit of speed ramping and all of those in, things yeah, in between it's it's just you just need to pay attention to details that's just it so speaking about let's talk about the castigator now what is the project about castigator is about a local superhero like mm. he's a local vigilante he's okay. not like superman per se but he has like a spiritual guide okay um it's See, the story is still unfolding. It's a guy that watches um, over the area, like make sure that there's no crime, okay. nothing. So if he, but I just did, just yes, you want some kind of jandu, could they want it? Yeah, just, but uh, happen, yeah. The guy don't fly, <laughs> okay. you know. And he's the guy that he's meant to do right. Okay. So there are consequences mm -hmm. when you say take a life. Mm -hmm. He will lose his power, like his punishment mm. for a while. It's just mm. you guys go check it out. On so YouTube. wait, about this guy, did you write the script yourself or did you? Well, not freestyle, bro. Are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> so not freestyle, you just thought it. No, you just create because something. I, I really can't wait for it to be big. I can't, mm. I can't, I can't wait to have like ten million. I can't wait to have five million mm. to be able to. to. So I decided. That. You know what let me just do like this short project mm -hmm. like let me just be putting out there mm -hmm. and and so far <laughs> see I, i'm in lagos with you people and i'm Adi. having this conversation so I'm, I'm in the right place I'm, I'm so let us let's be a bit technical on on the activity to put up uh, a scene like yeah. a, a, a fight, fight sequence. scene yeah a fight scene if you have a picture in your head let me give you an instance mm -hmm. imagine a situation where say i give you a punch and you're supposed to say go you're supposed to do like throw a, a black a back flip. flip yeah now if you can't yeah and i don't there, there, are, there are things that we can build to help you okay someone who does not you know you don't know anything about gymnastics yeah yeah, yeah there are things that we can do they, they have like this have black this rope that ropes, they yeah, yeah that can help that you can destroy help flip so you don't flip. fall yes. There are times when you're on a bike, you're on, the, the, the rope is tied to mm -hmm. you, some part of your body and mm -hmm. you're on a bike and you're about to go into a crash. Once the bike is, you know, colliding with the vehicle, mm -hmm. they just raise, they you, raise up, you up. So, yeah, they, so they know how to edit mm. it. But since I can't build all of that, mm -hmm. I just look for someone who's very good with gymnastics. So most, times, okay. most of the guys that I use are dancers. People who stunt. Mm. Mm. It's, it's, it's more like dance. It's a choreography. Yeah. When I'm like this, you are like this. When I'm like this, you are like this. When mm -hmm. I'm like this, you are like this. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, they. it's very easy for them to interpret that move mm -hmm. like they... It's, it's natural. To them, knowing yes, that it's, they it's very easy, have yes. the flair of moving. Yes, you know exactly. It's very respond to... Exactly. Mm. It's very natural. So how long would it easy. take you, if you're going to do like a fight scene, how long does it take you to... Well, for it to look very good, What's I mean, the longest it would be nice to at least, at least rehearse for like two weeks. Two weeks? Yeah, it would be nice. Wow. You know, just that's like yeah. shooting a full Nigerian Asaba movie. <laughs> 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 But you want to shoot two films. <laughs> okay. Now, look, at, you said something about working with uh, with AY. AY yeah, reached out to you yeah. to do a stunt for him in his movie, the, the Merry Men movie, right? Yes. Okay, so tell us, how was that for you? I was very nervous. I, was, I won't lie, I was mm -hmm. super nervous. Uh, he sent me the script, I read the script, and I, I had to go through like uh, all the parts where they were fighting. Yes. And I'm like, okay. Um, I, I met him, it was very simple. Mm -hmm. um, then his set was different, you know. Normally, me, I would just have maybe like two normal cameras and yeah. we'll do our thing. Mm -hmm. But they have all of the, the crew, the equipment, the everything. Equipment, everything was so it was very scary. But mm -hmm. what he did, he just gave me the room, the director, everybody, the team, they just allowed me to just express myself, just okay. do your thing. Okay. So when they have an idea, and they feel like, okay, you know what, this is too technical. Why don't we make this look more Nigerian? Mm. And they come in and, you know, we we'll find a way to just... To make it work. To make it work. Mm. So, yeah, there was just always a place where we met. But it was really cool working with them. They now, gave me the room to express And myself. now knowing that you were going to be training, I think Faust was on that movie. Or yeah. Or Ramsey Noah, J. Mike. And these guys are not... I don't think they have that skill to do all these things. But how were you able to work with them? 
Okay. Like, you know, I told you earlier on when you when you want to shoot a fight movie, it's always nice that you rehearse. But as it is, because it's a like really major, major production, production yeah. there's a lot of money being spent. Mm -hmm. So what they do is maybe they have like three days straight for fight scenes okay. and they do all that. All that. So at that point, you just have to, they might not necessarily get it like you will do it. Mm -hmm. Especially, there's something about teaching someone something when they teach you. When you're used to the move, mm -hmm. it now becomes a thing. It's it's it's, it's a part of you. Mm. So you it's, it becomes very natural with you. Mm -hmm. But uh, you have to teach people one day. Mm. You're like this. He's, he's conscious of the next move. He's bending. He's yeah, doing this. Yeah. So this like friction. It's, it's they, not really it's smooth. Smooth, but yeah. but with time. Yeah. It could. It could they, they, it was still good. Yeah. Did you ever learn martial arts? No, no. At uh, all. People ask me that question a lot. No. Uh -uh. No, but I used to dance one time. Oh. I used to rap one time. Yeah. I started with music. The first okay. time I got into a music studio was 2000. Wow. 2000. I was dreaming one day I'll be in a music video. 2013, I was in a music video. <laughs> wow. 13 years. Amazing. After that 13 years, yeah, I was thinking, okay, we did a music video. There was no money to promote. I think we shot it about 500,000. Yeah. We're looking for money to promote. The money not there. That's one the reason I say, ah, guy. You need to upgrade though. Yeah. That was why. Mm, that was and I decided to into... go into the whole editing thing and mm -hmm. uh, yes. Mm -hmm. And you know, I started evolving and discovering myself mm -hmm. more and I just wanted to stand out. So what's next from Spotlight? What should we expect from you next? Okay, uh, first of all, the Casigator is going to get bigger. Ah, yeah. oh, no, for sure. <laughs> um, uh, I, I, I've been in Lagos, I've met a couple of other people. I, I, I have plans to, you know, have like, cameos like guest appearances on um castigator oh. every episode like that you Makes know sense. Makes you know sense. the likes of you <laughs> yeah. i got my role man you but know. i'll beat you there. <laughs> i'll, I'll beat you. I'll i like i like to intimidate like you know people that are very yeah. tall uh, and uh, yeah but for a proper movie i'd like to make like an epic, an epic movie feel. like you know something close to black panther Hmm. It wouldn't necessarily look like a like Black Planter, but you know that storyline, kind of that African setting. Okay, you know, um, basically an epic movie. Hmm. It makes sense. Makes sense. So guys, ah, people who say that we don't have um, good action films and we don't have people who can make action movies, I think you guys have not seen Spotlight yet. You guys go and check out the Castigator. We can make action films. Go and check out the Castigator. And you might just watch the episode that I'll be inside. I'm just saying. <laughs> but you know how we do our Max stories? We bring you exceptional stories from exceptional Nigerians who are exceptionally making a difference in the country. So until next time, we're going to bring you someone else and something much more juicy. See you guys next time. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.